God will forgive us for what we must do. You'll forgive us, we'll forgive you. We'll forgive each other till we both turn blue. Then we'll whistle and go fishing in heaven. Fish and whistle, whistle and fish. Eat everything that they put on your dish. And when we get through, we'll make a big wish that we never have to do this Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am here with the Fisherman Fishing Planet, taking a break from the regular Classic Fishing Planet's Christmas event to come here and basically do another mission, because as I said before, I'm fairly early in just starting in this, and I kind of got away from it with all the events that's been going on with regular Fishing Planet, so I am glad to get back here. I can relax a little bit and just enjoy it, so... Let's come in here and see what we can do. I'm going to come over here to the Pike Challenge. Start off here and see if I have some good luck on that location. But we are taking part in a mission called the Pike Hunt 1 using a casting spoon. And we are trying to catch a grass pickerel at 1.3 pounds plus. In Emerald Lake, we're going to try to catch a change pi chain pickerel at 1.7 pounds plus, and then catch any pickerel 2.8 pounds plus. Now, I don't think we're going to see one of those here, <laughs> but we're going to at least get that one little guy here real quick here, because we could get us a trophy frog popper and nose kick butt, and it's something you can't get for a while yet. So. We're definitely going to take part in this, guys. This could give us a decent lure that we can use in this game early on. All right. Let's go ahead and jump in here and see what we can do about catching one of these guys. All right. So if you're catching a pickerel, you can catch any kind of pickerel. It didn't specifically say a certain pickerel. We are going to need advanced time here, guys, because this is not the peak time. We are going to need to go to 1 p.m. That's going to be nicer, too, because then we'll be able to see what we're doing. Yep. I'm starting with this silver one, and I tend to do very well with catching a pike and pickerel with this one. And this is one of my favorite spots, either from this end or the other end for these guys. Right through those stick-ups. Now if you see my Fishing Planet series, it pretty much works the same in both. We are going to do a stop and go to start off with. Might try lift and drop. Might get a snag. Let's take our tension down a little bit there. This is a half ounce, and part of the mission is you have to at least use. Damn, I'm getting a lot of snags here. A one aught or two aught. I don't know if that was somebody catching a fish or if that's just one jumping. Yeah, I think somebody caught one. Let's try right through here. The reason I get the silver and the gold because sometimes they just prefer to go for the gold. Kind of like uh, the Olympians or something. There we go. And I can't. I think this might be a pickerel because it's not fighting as hard as a bass. Nope, it is a bass. Damn. Nice bass, though. <laughs> not a bad bass. Not a bad bass at all. I definitely went after the twitch. Lift and drop is very hard to get. Can usually get it, but then it usually ends up going back to a twitch. But if you can get a lift and drop going, the pick will really like it. I 
Alright, let's see what we got here, guys. I think we got some kind of a pickerel. And we need to catch a grass pickerel. <laughs> Wouldn't you just know it? Let's come over here. I'm going to fish on this side. I hope I don't bother this guy too much. But I think he's fishing over on that side anyway, so... Oh, he's bottom fishing, too. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to try over here. Yeah, he was the right weight and everything. <laughs> it's like, that nabbit. Yeah, I can definitely catch a big pickerel in Emerald Lake. I know exactly where they are and how to get them. There we go. This might be what we're after. Unless it's another chain, it's another chain. <laughs> You little buggers. You little buggers. Okay, let's see what we got here, guys. Maybe, maybe. Nope, chain big roll. I think it's this darn lure, maybe too big. It's a little on the big side. Let me see. Let me check to see if there's some smaller ones here. Yeah, there's a one third, but it's not the hook's not big enough. Damn. See, that's not big enough either. That's where the challenge is, guys. It make it sound easy, but it's easy to catch the chain pickerel. The grass pickerel, not so much. <laughs> see what we got here. This might be a bass though. No. That's him. There he is. Trophy grass pickerel. That's a new personal record. Not bad. Patience. Patience grasshopper. Patience. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Well that's the first leg of this thing. I think what we need now do, to do is head off to Emerald Lake and see if we can't get the chain pickerel here, guys. Let's head on out. Alright, guys. We are here at Emerald Lake, and this is the prime location for catching the pickerel. We've got to get... A chain pickerel at least 1.7 pounds and then we need to catch any kind of pickerel at 2.8 pounds so it can be anything like the grass the chain or the red fin so it's our choice the chain will probably be easier to get but let me show you this spot guys I went out here on my boat and you can do it from over here where Damien 82 is 
if you can cast your line about 160 feet out, you're going to have to be able to do it at least that much. But it's hard to do with a lure, honestly. You need to do it with a float fish or float and uh, shiners. But we're going to see if we can't do it with this lure here, guys. That's a little trickier. They're obviously trying to challenge me here. Might try the gold one. I've been having more luck lately with the gold ones. Let's see here. I might go with a little. Well, you know, we could try the holographics. It wouldn't hurt. They're one odd, so it still fits. You never know. You never know what might happen when you try something a little different. As long as I don't get a snag. Gonna let that sink. I don't know if that was a bite or not. There we go, that's a bite. <laughs> It's a red fin. Little fella. <laughs> Little bitty guy. And a cute. Little bitty guy. But they're there. Ow. The weather has changed to rainy, so mm. that means that. Predators can pretty much bite evenly all day long. So that's good for walleye. It's good for these chain pickerel. There really isn't a peak point. There we go. Redfin pickerel. Not big enough. Damn. So close. One point seven pounds. We need one point seven pounds. Ah, shoot, we got snag on something. I think we got something. Yeah, we got a water lily. Let's try over here. There we go. This could be the one we need, guys. We'll see here. Ugh, so close. Trophy redfin pickerel. Yeah, the goat really does well on these rainy days like this. See what we got here, guys. I think we've got something significant this time. Oh, shoot. Just can't get quite to what we need. We are in the right location. Thank God. It's a matter of getting the right size. There we go. This could be our fish. Let's see, guys. Yep. I think we may have gotten it. No. Thank God. 
he was a personal record, but he wasn't the fish we needed. But we got to level 17, guys. That's always a plus. Anytime we level up, that's going to be more of a benefit to us. If it had been a chain pickerel or any kind of pickerel over 28.1 pounds, we would have had it. Alright guys, let's go ahead and see if we can't go back to the dock. Let's try from over here, guys. Sometimes I do better from the dock, to be honest. I mean, I know where I need to fish from, and it's right here. And that is the... Key location here, right here. There we go. We got something here. Right off the bat. Decent fish. Just a bit shy. Needs to be 1.7. Got another. Let's try it again. Silver is what we need here, that's for sure. Well, we've got plenty of activity here. It's just a matter of whether or not they want to. There we go. I only have something. Now, is he big enough? That's the problem. Is it going to be big enough? Or is it going to be the right species for that matter? <sighs> Still not big enough. Damn it. Right species, wrong size. Yeah, that's the big thing is to let it go all the way to the bottom. Stop and go should do it. We were getting... There we go. We were getting so many rainy days there for a while, though. That it was seriously affecting our chances. I don't think this guy is big enough, though. I think it might be a chain pickerel, just not big enough. Dang on it. Well, they're definitely here. Just gotta find the big enough guy here. If we 
Just get the bigger fish. Now, if we were fishing for... Alright, this is a big fish, guys. This may be the one we need, guys. This may be it. I was starting to wonder if I was going to catch him. Let's see. nice if we could get both a pickerel over 2.8 pounds and a chain pickerel 1.7. I wonder if you could do it at one time. A unique would do it. And this guy is seriously big. Damn. Come on. Come on. He is really giving me a fight here, guys. This guy is big. See what he is here. Holy crap! He he did trophy chain pickerel. He completed both of those. He is not a unique, but there you go. Trophy chain pickerel. I know. I knew he was a decent sized fish. That completes our missions, guys. Did it all at one time. So we've unlocked the uh, Everglades. Oh, man, it's about time. That is some serious cash that we can bring in, guys. The Everglades, and we've got the three quarters, three quarter ounce spoon, three aught jerk big five eight ounce night crawlers now. Yeah, we've got things, and we got this trophy frog popper. That makes a big difference, guys. That is what we wanted, guys. We managed to not only get the mission, we also got the another level. So, we can move on to the Everglades. The Everglades is a big place to make some serious cash and some serious amounts of fish. Because with that popper, I am going to kill on the largemouth bass, guys. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please, please, please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with the next episode of The Fisherman Fishing Planet. So until then, guys, I will see you later. Bye-bye.